I'm James. We're in the Net News Ledger newsroom with Nancy Milani from the Thunder Bay Chamber of Commerce. Nancy, we're heading into the end of the year. We are. It's uh, come quickly and we are at our probably final event coming up for the year. It's certainly our final after business event taking place on November 19th at the Thunder Bay Community Auditorium. So we're going to get all the business people in town up on stage. They're going to be doing a play or what are we going to be doing? No, we're going to do some networking, definitely. Uh, it's a bit of a mini trade show too, so we expect to have over 25 exhibitors there showcasing their products and services, talking a little bit about what they do, and just a really good opportunity for networking with other business people. It's also a lot of fun. We've been doing the after business and, and you meet a lot of business people here in the city, so it's a good event to get to. Absolutely. It is a lot of fun and uh, there's always some great food to, to go along with it. And, and just as you said, just a really good opportunity to meet some new people or reconnect with people that maybe you haven't seen in a bit. So if somebody wants to get involved? All they have to do is contact either Kayla at the Chamber or go to our website, tbchamber.ca. Go to events. You can book some exhibit space on there if you're a Chamber member or you can just attend for the evening. It's only $5 to get in. Probably the least expensive thing that'll be on at the Community Auditorium. I would think so, yes. So as we look forward into 2015, we have a busy year coming up as always. We will start up with the After Business program once again in January. The first one in January is going to be held at the Victoria Inn and it is a poolside party which was a lot of fun last year with kind of a bit of a travel theme. Uh, we will continue for the balance of the year on the third Wednesday of the month. We also have coming up date yet to be determined is the state of the city so that'll be the mayor's address. We always look forward to that. The business awards will be taking place in April of 2015 15, and I know it seems early to talk about them, but we are asking people to nominate a business and you can do that very easily by going on our website again tvchamber.ca and do a nomination for a business in terms of customer service or great partnerships. All the criteria is there. There's about 14 different awards and we want to get a lot of nominations and we want to celebrate the great businesses we have in this community. That's a, a good thing to be doing in Thunder Bay. We, we often hear you know people talk about the negative things, but there's so many positives happening in Thunder Bay. There certainly is, and I think people tend to forget about that at times. So this is where, this is an event, and it's a wonderful gala event, where we really want to celebrate the businesses, because we have a lot of very, very unique and very creative and very successful businesses here in Thunder Bay. So I'm James with Net News Ledger. I'm here in the newsroom with Nancy Milani from the Chamber of Commerce talking about the next after business.